hey guys welcome back again to another cooking video in today's video i share with you guys how i make this delicious bitter leaf soup that you can enjoy with any swallow of your choice for this soup we are enjoying it with the starch okay watch this video guys let me show you how i make this soup okay all right guys i've already cleaned my prunes that i will be using for the for the soup okay i have goat meat momo uh, chicken and uh, chaki what i did i had the uh, maggi and salt now i'm adding some blended pepper and uh, onions okay then i'll cover it i like to steam for about uh, 15 minutes on its own juice okay all right guys this is 15 minutes later as you can see then what i'm going to do next i'm going to add in my uh, stock fish okay i've already cleaned my stock fish with uh, hot water okay it's well clean then i had it to eat then i'm going to add in my blended tomatoes dry pepper and onions to eat okay then i'll give it a a quick stir then i had in more water so that it will cook for about another 10 minutes okay thank you all for stopping by i appreciate every one of you if you are new to my channel welcome uh please don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and don't forget to share after watching uh s will be a great 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 gesture for you to do if you watch like and share okay all right i've added water to it then uh, i'm stirring it up okay you know i like stirring my soup <laughs> then after stirring i'll go ahead and add some uh palm oil okay red palm oil okay just a little because even this soup italian soup you can even cook it without no uh, palm oil it's, it all depends on your choice okay i added a little bit of palm oil then i cover it i like to steam for about five minutes okay this is five minutes later while the meat was cooking i went ahead and blending my my uh, bitterly soup uh, my bitter leaf okay because the bitter leaf is a dry one i soak the bitter leaf overnight then uh, the next day i wash it very well then i blended it with my blend okay now this is the bitter leaf i'm just gonna add it to eat okay and what i love about this soup this soup is so medicinal okay this soup is very good it's very medicinal like if you have any kind of uh, maybe cold or a uh, sore throat cook this soup with a lot of pepper you will enjoy this soup it's very good it will clean your system okay now i just take a little bit okay then i'm going to add in my crayfish blended crayfish and uh, i'll add in more uh, maggi and uh, salt okay there is no seasoning and salt okay that's what I just added to it. Then I'll add a little bit of uh, banga spice. Okay, I love the aroma of banga spice in my bitter leaf soup. Okay, that's what I just add to it. You can skip that. It's, it's not. Uh, it's optional. Okay, you can decide to have some uh, native spice. It all depends on you. But for me, I love adding some a little bit of banga spice to my bitter leaf okay i cover it up then i like to cook as you can see right now the aroma was giving i wish you guys can perceive the aroma from the from the scream okay oh my goodness the aroma was giving it was so super so delicious guys okay and i give it a, a stir then I'm gonna add, <coughs> excuse me. I'm gonna add in my dry tilapia fish. Okay, I oven dry this tilapia fish by myself. Okay, you can even use fresh fish if you wish to, but I just want to use a 
dry fish okay or you can use a fresh uh, mackerel fish okay which is also good you can use any fish of your uh, choice depends on what you have at home okay your, it doesn't matter the important thing that is the food tastes good after you cook, finish cooking it okay now i tested for salt it needed a little bit of salt then i had a salt i cover it i like to cook as you can see, the soup is almost done. At this point, the soup is already done, guys. I just want it to thicken up, uh, allow the soup to thicken uh, a little bit, okay? Now, I start a little bit, and uh, the soup, our soup is ready. By the time you allow it to cool down, it's going to thicken more, okay? It all depends on how the thickness, you uh, how you want it, okay? This soup is very good. You can enjoy this soup with pade de yam. Oh my goodness. Or you can enjoy it with starch, which is my favorite. I like eating my bitale soup with starch. Okay. Now the soup is ready. I went ahead and made a uh, starch as you can see. Look at the soup. It's giving. Thank you all for watching. I hope you guys enjoy watching this video. If you do, don't forget to like and share. I'll see you all in my next one. Bye-bye. Stay safe and stay blessed.